Um, before I allow past me to intro the video, uh, in this video, I actually made a lot of progress on Cataclysm. Like, way more than I was expecting to, or even hoping to. Um, so yeah, stick around to the, <laughs> to the end of the video for that, uh, and I'll allow my, my fat head self to, you know, get on with it. Okay, look, King Yappa, aka Top Waffler, welcome back to the second channel. I know it's actually been a little bit since I last uploaded on here. I'm sorry, I apologize. Please accept my apology. But, um, it's because I've not really been doing much. I've not really completed much. I completed, well, okay, uh, I completed another insane demon. I completed Supersonic, uh, as preparation for this level, uh, which I, I want to be my first extreme demon. A lot of people told me don't play Cataclysm because it's, like, not, like, a fantastic level. From what I've played so far, I actually disagree. Like, I, I, I think this level's solid. I, I, I like the music, I like how it flows, I, just, I, I like the level, so yeah, I'm going for it. Also, it's, it's quite an iconic one, you know? It, it'll, it'll be, it's a good one to have as my first extreme, and it's not too hard. Accu looks awful. I'm not playing that, okay? But I'll show you my run of Supersonic, um, which is what you, you'll see. Uh, and then we'll go for some runs on Cataclysm. I don't know what, maybe we'll try to go 50 to 100 or... Something like that, uh, yeah. Uh, before we do, very quickly, listen, it takes two seconds, two seconds. Leave a like, subscribe, helps me out a lot. Uh, I'm very close actually on the channel to become an YouTube partner, so, you know, I would I would really appreciate that, honestly. Okay, so Supersonic Completion, yeah, here's the thing. This level actually took me ages. Uh, it took me like, oh, how many attempts? I think around 7K. But the thing is, I found this way easier than both Arcane and Poltergeist, which are the other two insanes I've beat. Oh, yes. Okay, not way easier than Arcane. I think it's comparable to Arcane, but I think this was way easier than Poltergeist, right? Like, I, nothing in this level is hard, but it took me a long time to beat. I'm not really sure why. Uh, it's just the inconsistent ball at, like, is it 60% or... I don't know, but this level's free. I was relaxing. Every single run I would get here at the very minimum. And then maybe I died to the next like damage, upside down ship or like, I don't know. Either way, out. I beat this level. Okay. When I'm not uh, my shadow play wasn't on. So <laughs> this is same day. Same day that I already beat this level. I had to come back and beat it again. It's it's this part. Uh, the entrance to this jewel is inconsistent. Sometimes you'll just die because you won't enter it right. And then this is like really just. It's not inconsistent. I, I It's just it's weird. It's a weird part. And then this ship is like. Not the easiest. From here, it's quite free. Honestly, this wave is impossible to die to. It's the freest wave I've ever seen in my life. For an insane demon, especially. And then, got a little memory section, which uh, took me so long to learn, bro. My brain is not... It's so bad. Actually. I pick up things quickly, but slowly. Yeah, I, it, it, it doesn't make sense. Now, if we're going to... I'll let the completion finish first, but, but if you've played Supersonic Ball, I need to know if it's just yes! me. Yes! Yeah, I was gassed. Because I thought, bro... I already beat this level. I thought, you know, when you beat a level you've been playing for so long, like it was like a good like three or four days I've been playing this, right? And you know, when you finally beat it, you're like, thank fuck, I never have to play this level again. You know what I'm saying? You can completely erase it from your mind, erase it from your memory, leave it in the past. But Shadow Play wasn't working and I wanted to have a Shadow Play of it. So I was like, okay, fuck it, I have to beat it again. So I was gassed when I beat it because, yeah, I didn't want <laughs> to do this shit even more. But if you play this level, please tell me it's not just me that this is the most inconsistent part of it by far these jumps like those three portals there i don't know what it is but it was just inconsistent as fuck and this ship was like one of the hardest parts of the level which is it's obviously in the last two percent of the level it's not fucking ideal is it but yeah honestly i did not find that level hard it just took me fucking ages to beat uh, I, I don't know. It's weird. It's hard to explain, I guess. I don't know. Well, not that I didn't find it hard, but I guess compared to, um, what's it called? Like, you know, Poltergeist and Arcane, like, it really wasn't that bad of a level. Okay. Uh, yeah. So, Cataclysm, I've, tr I've tried a, a decent amount. Uh, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. I don't feel, like, close to beating it, but, like, I don't know why I'm not putting checkpoints down. Let me put a fucking checkpoint down there. Uh, also, worst timing ever, and another reason why I didn't upload is because I kind of wasn't playing the game for a little bit, because, um, they fuck, they removed fucking Geod, bro, and not only did, you know, does that mean CBF is gone? Okay, I don't know how the fuck I got past all the hard parts and died there, but, but yeah, anyway, uh, not only was CBF gone, um, so is, like, Auto Nong, so, you know what I'm saying, I can't use fucking Nongs, Auto Song, so I actually have to... I'm saying move my move my hand two centimeters on my mouse pad and download the song myself. Um 
CBF is obviously a fucking big one. Uh, wave trail. So as you can see right now, my wave trail in this setup is supposed to be like, like pink, you know? And it looks sick. But it's fucking black, which, you know, nothing against, nothing against blacks. But, um, you know, especially on Cataclysm, uh, black wave trail is not very fucking easy to see. Especially in the part after the, the first ship, which you'll see. The wave trail is actually invisible, which is, you know, not fantastic. I could change the color, but no, I'm stubborn. This wave's actually usually quite consistent for me. I don't know why I'm, like, fumbling so fucking hard right now, but to be fair, I've not played yet today, so. But I can't lie. Launching this game and realizing Geode had been fucking final snapped. I, I thought I was going to be finished, God. Because I, I thought I was like CBF carried, you know? Because obviously I, I use CBF. But, okay, stop dying. What the fuck is wrong with me? But, um, it actually, yeah, I can't lie. It's not made a difference. <laughs> it's actually not made a difference. And I guess it's because I, I already have like 360 hertz. And I might add a sale device came. I bought a fucking sale device. Because they're cheap as fuck. And I thought, why not? So that, that has probably offset it. I can't lie. Offset the fucking... Offset the loss of, you know, CBF. But it's just Geo is such like a quality of life thing, bro. Like this game, it made me realize that like, I don't know how, how the fuck brothers play this game without like Geo or Mega Hack or or whatever. Like there's just so much quality of life shit just just gone. Bro, I want to play with my left hand today. I did like endurance training yesterday, and my fucking arm hurts so much just clicking a button. Even like it's actually shocking. Uh, but all, all this is fine. Okay, yeah, never mind. There we go. But as, as you can see, like, you can't even fucking see my wave there. Um, oh wait, I'm the GOAT. Okay, what the fuck out. <laughs> That's what I mean, I want to go for a run today. I'm not sure from where to where, but... I think like 50 to 100 is always a solid run, because then you can get the run in two parts, right? Or I might try go even earlier than that, because... I might try from that UFO. I can't lie, I am quite heavily fucking nerfing myself. <laughs> Having a black wave trail for this next section, but the the wave is so free that it, it doesn't actually really matter. I can't lie. Like, you should never die here. Okay, there was extra pressure then because I said you should never die. <laughs> should never die ever. It's actually not that bad. The first couple times I got to this ball on, like, practice runs on this map, like, the you know, like, the first couple times I ever played this map, my brain... I, this is what I mean when I say it's, like, weird. My brain... Once I... It, okay, I did this section and I thought it was over. I thought, okay, I'm never beating Cataclysm because this ball felt... Okay, and I can't do it right now. Because I'm waffling. Hold on. Thank you. Yeah, like, it, it just... It did not make sense in my head at all. Like, I could not make sense of it, bro. I, and I woke up one day. Or, like, the next day or whatever. Because it was, like, two days, maybe. I, I played this level. Because I wasn't really taking it seriously because I, I didn't know if I wanted to go for it yet. So I was just... I was just giving it some attempts, right? Uh... And yeah, that, like I said, felt fucking impossible. And then I woke up one day, I thought, oh, let me try Cataclysm again. And it was the freest thing ever. And I never died there. And it's like, okay. I, like, I don't understand how my brain fucking works like that. Like, I know most people's brains work like that. That's how muscle memory fucking works. But it's just, it's just really weird. Like, I feel like me more than others, though. Because, it, bro, I remember I played a level um, that had, like, it was the first time I came across, like, gravity portals in a wave level. It was some fucking easy demon. On the, on the GDDP or whatever. Uh, and it, like, I genuinely, I couldn't, like, my brain couldn't fucking comprehend it. Is it, it It's not even like, because <laughs> obviously everything in this game is just a click pattern, but my brain couldn't fucking make sense of it. Is this from the UFO? I don't know where this is from. Okay, uh, I don't know why I was acting like I was about to get some fucking run to 100, but it is from the UFO. So what's this from 30, 35? I should probably, you know what, I've decided, because the second half of this level is so much easier than the first half, I think we should, we should go for a run, 35 to 100, keyword is go for, not do a run, 35, okay, I can take, I can put both hands on the fucking keypad now, give my forearm a break, but yeah, not get a run, 35 to 100, because you know, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not trying to sit here for fucking three hours recording like I did with uh, the Poltergeist video, but um, we can try. Uh, why am I dying to the UFO? It's the freest part of the level. Speaking of the Port Guys video, if you watched that, um, you might remember I was chatting about spiders, right? And how we shouldn't really be scared of them. Because most of them are. Especially if you live in a country where there's no, like, fucking poisonous spiders. None that can do any damage to you. Because there's actually no logical reason to be scared of them. And it's dumb that we're scared of them, right? I was just, I was just talking about that. I was talking about how much I fucking hate slugs. But anyway, in that video, I said that, like really and truly 
We should be eating spiders for fucking protein, right? You know what happened the day after? Oh, it actually might have been the same fucking night, bro. And I've been holding on to this story for like nine days now, because, you know, obviously, um, I've been slacking with the fucking uploads on here. But, uh, I went to make a fucking protein shake, and, bro, like, I seal. I, I'm the only person in this fucking house, right? I mean, out of the, the two people that live in this fucking house, but... Anyway, I'm the only person that, that uses the protein, yeah? And, bro, I, I, I make sure it's sealed every single time. That's, like, the main thing I do is I seal the fucking bag because it's, like, it goes fucking clumpy and shit if you don't. Like, it's, you know, I make sure I do that, okay? And no one else fucking uses it. And, bro, tell me why I go in there, bro, to, to grab some fucking protein and there's a little bit extra protein in there, if you know what I mean. You know, there was... A <laughs> Bro, tell me why there's a fucking spider in my protein. Okay, I need to stop waffling when I actually get past the, the hard part because trying to get this run, you know, but, but tell me why there's a fucking spider in the protein powder bag. Like, what the fuck, bro? Like, the same day or... It, it was either the same day or day after. I don't remember, but... You know, that I was talking about how we should be fucking crunching these brothers for, for extra protein. I think I hit the wrong orb there. It's cringe. But it's like, bro, God wanted to test me. <laughs> he wanted to see if I'd fucking stand on business, bro, and eat the spider. I should have done it, but, you know, I was I was feeling fucking merciful that day. I was feeling merciful. I fucking grabbed him with the scoop and slapped that brother outside. It wasn't like a like a huge spider, but it also wasn't like a little spider. You know, like the spiders that are just, you know, specks. You know, tiny little, like, money spiders. I don't know what... Do you call them money spiders in America as well? I don't know. How the fuck did I just die there? But, like, it was like a... If I say medium-sized, you know, like... <laughs> You know, because large in the UK is not the same as large in, like, America or Australia. You know, like, like large in Australia is like a fucking cat. <laughs> so if I say middle-sized, you know, that's like... Yeah. Uh, but you know what I mean. Hopefully you, you can picture the, the fucking size of spider it was. Okay. Let me lock in a little bit. Fuck, I'm ass. I think 35 to 100 is doable. Uh, this second half of the level is by far the, the, the section I've practiced the fucking most. And it's, it's actually not even close. Like, the first half I've not even really practiced yet. Um, but I thought I would save going for an actual run of the second half of the level for a video. I was going to go for 50 to 100, but I'm clocking like... This part is really not that bad. Okay, it is. <laughs> but, like, why go for 50 to 100 if I can go from 35 to 100? Because it's not even really 35 to 100. Because this UFO is free. So it's actually 40 to 100. But it's not even really 40 to 100. Okay, UFO is free. This is, like, not free. That's actually, I think, the hardest part of the level, maybe. For me, anyway. Um, this part. And then this part is free. Watch me die here. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense, but I talked, so of course I'm going to die there. That's rule number one, but I'll never fucking get gassed. Never say, oh, this is fucking easy. And then you will get smited down. Straight back to reality, actually. And while we're on the topic of um, spiders, I actually I encountered, bro, one of the, the biggest Twitter mutants I've ever seen in my life, bro. Once again, like, I really and truly, but I wish I didn't use that app. The only reason I do is to, to keep up with, like, Brahala stuff, you know, for the, for the first channel, the main channel. I don't even want to call it the main channel, bro. I prefer this channel. <laughs> like, you know, the Browler channel, you know? Does it get boring? But tell me in the comments if it gets boring, like, just watching me. Because, you know, like, do this UFO over and over again. Like, I feel like it gets really boring. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. There's, like, no other way to record this game, you know? I can't... Because here's the dilemma, bro. It's either I talk during the easy part, which is this UFO, right? Or, you know, it, which means, like, you know, the only time I'm... You see the screen is when I'm talking, obviously, and, and then it's just me on this fucking UFO dying over and over again. Or it's, you know, I only talk during the, you know, the runs where I get past UFO. But then it's like, when the runs where I get past UFO is when I need to not talk. Like, it's a, it's it's, a, it's all a fucking big paradox, bro, actually. But yeah, but if, if reality actually was anything like Twitter or Discord or, you, you know what I'm saying? I promise I would not be here anymore, bro. I, I wouldn't be able to fucking handle it. I thank God brothers aren't like that in real life, but... But just one of the many fucking Twitter mutants I've been lately, bro, is, uh... You might have seen X Defiant, which I was actually going to record an X Defiant video for the channel, but... I still might. Let me know if you want to see that, I guess, but... Um... I have another game, actually, that I'm going to I'm gonna do first. That is not Geometry Dash. 
I will still be grinding though. I will still be playing this game, but uh, yeah, it was so it was some woman playing fucking X Defiant, and there's like a an ability in that game where you can like, you know, throw like a fucking robot spider at somebody, and it like goes onto your screen like that. Like the spider like jump scares your screen a little bit. It doesn't really. Just imagine the effect. Imagine in any like Call of Duty game, like it's it's just like a robot spider you send after somebody. And when it reaches them, it like hugs their face, you know? And just imagine how that would look in the game. Like it's... Anyway, well, there was a whole tweet going about like, please, you know, this this gives me a panic attack. You know, I, can <laughs> I can't play your game because, because I have arachnophobia and you need to add an arachnophobia mode. Oh my fucking days, bro. Brothers, actually, I don't know. Seriously, I, I don't know how. I don't know how these people, these type of people live life bro uh, like it, everything just must be fucking it just life must be so difficult for them bro and it's like out of their own volition too like let me say i'm not gonna sympathize with them bro it's like the classic fucking twitter mutant or discord mutant bro it's it's but like I, I don't know how the fuck they get on with life it's it's too much like growing up on the internet bro and being so sheltered and stuff like it it makes sense how it happens but it, it doesn't you know make it any better fucking i'm ass you know the worst thing about these type of people that just like get offended over absolutely fucking everything and live like a live a life of being a victim like well there's tools you know you have every single tool at your disposal to moderate what you see but like that's not enough for these people you know they need nobody to have to experience it you know people that like like for example let's say like the way shit works now online is like and like i said it, it this is, it doesn't happen in real life thankfully uh but let's say there's a comedian that somebody gets really offended by right also i'm i don't i don't find stand-up comedy funny at all but i, I keep it so real uh, that's a separate topic but anyway yeah uh, let, let's say there's one and someone fucking hates them right everything they say offends them so much right and it's not that they just wouldn't watch the comedian <laughs> It's not that they just wouldn't like, you know, interact or watch the comedian and, and just, you know, moderate what they see. They need that comedian's career to be finished. They need it so that nobody can enjoy it. Fuck. I, why am I talking there? Like, that's where I should be looking in. But yeah, like, like brothers aren't satisfied with, you know, just them not seeing the thing that offends them. They need everybody to also be offended by it and everybody to also not be able to see it. Even if other people find it funny. It's like, if they find it offensive, then it is offensive. You know, it's not funny. Which is like, how come that's the, the thing people go with instead of like the <laughs> the opposite, which is it is funny and it's not offensive. Or it could be both. It could be funny and offensive. And you know what you do in that situation? The people who don't care that it's offensive can go and have a laugh. And the people that do find it offensive could just like moderate what they see. Like that's completely fine. You know, like it's completely okay to, to, to not find it funny. But if, if people do, let them. That was fucking scuffed, actually. Let's go for a run. I've been doing too shit lately. I oh, know I fucked it. I fucked it really badly. If you do that too late, the clicks just don't work. Like, it's really cringe. I don't know. It's just really weird how people have evolved to be like that, you know? Like, because, like I said, you can, you can just go and find it. You can become a victim in any way you want, but it, brothers actually choose to live a life of, like, being a victim. And, I like, why would you do that? It's just, it's unhappy, you know? And then they find other people to do the same with them, and it's just a big echo chamber of, like, being a fucking victim, and, you know, they, they enable it for each other, and it's just fucking crazy. Well, I, I could talk about this shit for hours. I promise, bro. And I could explain how fucking stupid it is, bro. And how we've ended up. But, like, it, it's <laughs> the win-win situation. It's just let people fucking do what they want, bro. And, you know, it, bro, like, companies, for example, will pretend that they're also offended by these. Like, bro, YouTube monetization rules, we all know how fucking stupid they are, bro. Like, it, it, you can't do shit on this fucking platform anymore. And it's because of people like that. Like, it's, it's so dumb. All right, let me not fumble this again. I'm so or fucking horrifically bad at this game. It's like, if you want to avoid something, you want to create like a movement of some kind or, or whatever, right? Like, 
completely entitled to do that, you know, and uh, I think everyone should have the right to do that, you know, but, you know, everyone should also have the right to not have to go along with, with whatever the fuck, you know, it, you get what I'm saying, like, I've said this before, but, but it's like, it's, it, but, like, listening to music, okay, if you don't want to listen to fucking drill music, you know, and my brothers fucking killing each other, you know, all this stuff, like, it's, don't have to do it. But, 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 you know, you can go listen to fucking pop music. The option is there. You know, there's nothing forcing you to listen to it, but, <laughs> you know, it's like saying, oh, we need to ban it. <laughs> but just don't fucking listen to it. Like, it's actually really that simple. There's nothing stopping you from living in a, in a bubble and just, you know, listening to the music you do like. You don't have to ban all the music you don't like, you know, <laughs> you know for people that do like it. Like, people have different tastes. It's just that people with some tastes think that their taste is the only taste that matters and... And everyone else has to follow the exact same worldview that they have. And, oh, this shit, boy. It's so cringe. I don't know how I've even got into this fucking conversation on a... On a John Dash fucking, you know, YouTube video. But, you know, here, here we are. Do you not agree, though? You know what I'm talking about? Like, there's, there's just... Um, there's a million fucking examples of it, bro. Oh my fucking god, man. That was actually it. That was actually it, but you know, that's the most inconsistent part of that level of this level for me. I think I think it's it's this ship after the UFO uh is like quite inconsistent. Oh, it is, but it isn't. I don't know. It's yeah, and then that, you know, like at the end of that fucking duel where I just died on those spikes, like flying all the way up, but like not flying too high because then you die, but then not flying too low because then you don't you can't straighten out in time. Like, it's so... It looks... It, it, it is so much more... Oh, okay. It feels, anyway, to me. So much more precise than it looks. It doesn't look that hard, but... That part of the level, for me, is just so fucking... The rest is free. If I'd have cleared those spikes... If I'd have gone, like, a centimeter further then... Probably would have beat it, because the wave is free. And then it's just like a... A little straight fly at the end, like... It's not hard. It's like, I remember there was a big thing, bro. Back when I used to play Rainbow uh, Rainbow Six Siege, like, in, like, 20 fucking 17, bro. Like, like a long time ago, right? It was, like, a big thing of people trying to get voice chat removed, in-game voice chat removed. Because, like, people would use it to, to harass people and... Like, that is a prime example of what I'm talking about, bro. Because you know what you can do? In-game, it gives you the tools to... <laughs> It gives you the fucking tools to just mute people. Like, it, it, like, bro, if you don't want to listen to it, that's completely fine, but you don't have to. You can mute people. But people who do want to use it, you know, use it. And if anyone says anything that, you know, you don't like, just mute them. And then li literally nothing can happen after that, you know? It, <laughs> but yeah, obviously the thing I relate to the most is like the whole thing with like YouTubers, right? Where, you know, brothers will just cancel YouTubers or try and cancel YouTubers that they don't find funny. It's like, why do you have to do that? Why do you feel the need to take that away from people that do find it funny? Like, what? why does... It I just... It doesn't make sense to me, bro. <laughs> that was just so trash. That was so fucking pathetic, bro. That was such like a, oh my god, bro, the most flaccid fucking jump I've ever ever inputted in this game. Anyway, enough fucking Omega Supreme waffling, bro. I, I'm on 600 fucking attempts. I, <laughs> I've actually, you know what is good, though? This is why I need to stream this game more often, because I will be improving, right? Even though, like, I'm not, I've not been paying really close attention to it. Like, I will be improving subconsciously somehow. My master memory will be improving for the level. And the time has passed so quickly. I've actually just been sat here fucking waffling. Um, but yeah, time to time to actually you know what I'm saying, get into the torture. And just fucking put my head down and try and get 35 to 100. If you do want to see streams, actually. Maybe a bit late in the video to promote it. But uh, follow me on Twitch. Um, link is in the description, I think. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, but 
yeah, maybe I will try and stream this game more, especially Cataclysm, because I'm not going to sit here and record like five videos of me playing Cataclysm. Like, it will just get boring. The next video, I will probably be me beating the level, if anything. So, um, if I ever do beat it, we'll have to see. I'm gonna die to the street fly. Hold oh, no. <laughs> on. <laughs> oh, no. oh, no. What the fuck? I knew it was coming. I don't even know if I want to continue after that, bro. I don't even know if I want. Oh, maybe I'll, I'll do a few more attempts. Fuck it. I don't know why I just X out of the level. Now I've got to do all this shit again, bro. I am going to die to that straight fly on an actual run. You see how I did it perfectly? And then my brain, for some reason, just said, like, oh, just fly straight up at the end of it. Like, <laughs> yo, I've forgotten to start of the level now. I don't remember how any of this shit got. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Free. Oh my god, bro, I'm actually the biggest choke artist in this game. I think I might be. I think I might be, bro. The amount of times I died at 87 on fucking Poltergeist. The amount of times I died at the end of Supersonic, bro. Fucking, I'm gonna die to the straight fly on this level. It's just, anytime, do you know what happens, bro? I do something, okay? I do something correctly. I do something well. And then my brain goes, oh, you've done it. You know, time to let loose. <laughs> but, <laughs> but my brain tells me that. Before I have actually done it, you know? So it's like, I'm actually a fucking, I'm actually a choke artist. Don't die. Thank you. I should never ever die there. Maybe we should just go for for like a, an 18 to 100 run. I don't know what the point of that would ever be. You know, at that point, I can't lie. Just go for fucking runs. Why waste your time trying to get an 18 to 100 run, you know? Like, just go for fucking runs at that point. See, like, I don't die to that shit anymore, but yeah, it's... My brain doesn't work. Okay, here we are. We're back. You know what? I want my checkpoint closer. Uh, that might shave milliseconds off my life, but... Oh, wait. Shave milliseconds back onto my life. What's the opposite of shave? Graft. It might graft milliseconds. <laughs> Is that the word for when you get like... Oh, no. It's like a transplant, isn't it? Fucking... When you go to Turkey and you get a new hairline. I'm glad my hairline isn't receding. You know, I've got a fat forehead, but, you know, that's just because I've got a fat forehead, you know? I've got a big forehead, but... My, uh... You know, I'm getting on. I'm getting old these days, but I'm 21. I've not started, not started to see any, any re re receding this. I don't know to, to catch it fucking receding. Yeah, which is, um, thank God, actually. I'm, uh, I'm not trying to have a receding hairline, actually. It's not, uh, it's not optimal. If you really think about it, a receding hairline is not fucking optimal. If I die to the straight fly at the end of the level again, though, my hairline will instantly recede. Like, you'll see it live on camera. It will recede, like, two feet back. Oh, okay. And when I say two feet back, like... I mean two feet back, bro. I'm gonna look at one of those old brothers that have, like, only hair on the sides of the head. Which... By the way... What the fuck is the point? Like... You need to let it go at that point. I can't... You actually have to fucking let it go. It's not a haircut at that point, boy. It's fucking inverted... You've got to cut hair. Like, does anyone think that shit looks good? No offense if you're like, you know what I'm saying, 45 and balding watching this video and you only have hair on the side of your head, but... Well, or, you know, if your dad only has hair, you know, no offense to your dad, if that's him, but... Help him out, well, <laughs> shave that shit off for him, but it's not, it's not good.
This has to be the last attempt. <laughs> Thank God. What the actual fuck, man. That was actually quick. That was like 100 attempts. Was it? I don't know, but... Yeah, that shit got a lot more consistent. How many? 113. 113. 35 to 100 in 113 attempts is... Well, okay, but like... Obviously, it's about a thousand attempts if we if we take into account, you know, the pre, <laughs> you know, the rest of the attempts. But um, we'll take that, bro. Yeah, this level it feels so unbelievably fucking far away. But at the same time, if I can do thirty five to one hundred, I don't think the start of the level is harder. Obviously, I think the first wave is harder than most of the second level, but it is it's it's right at the start. So if you pass that, you have a run, right? So I might just keep practicing 35. Uh, I don't know. Listen, I, I will try and do it soon. And I will try and stream it as well. I, I, that, that would probably be the smartest fucking idea. Anyway, if you made it to this point in the video, truly thank you so much. Uh, it means a lot that you're watching the second channel and, and helping to support me. Because obviously it's still small. It's still growing. And like, I enjoy doing this shit so much. But I've uh, been able to play. Because like, the only reason I'm doing Jump Slash on the channel is just because the that's the game I'm enjoying playing right now. You know? I feel like without this channel, I wouldn't be in like... I wouldn't really I, like, like I'm beating these levels not only like for me but for you lot as well like it just being able to record these videos it makes the experience of playing games like so much better like gaming for me is quite dead like I don't enjoy it as much as I used to but when I'm making videos for this channel and shit like I enjoy the games I'm playing so much more you have no idea and like it it just I don't know like it's, it's a really good feeling uh, and thank you for allowing me to do that you know so yeah leave a like subscribe if you're not already um uh, and i'll read out the channel members from the other channel because i've not unlocked it on this channel yet actually i think i might have unlocked it on this channel i'll see if i can enable it soon but anyway for now more room at brandenburg eric's okay janwell fish sticks two that tomorrow no waffles ashman scene kenji joker equus no glory fat job raskari again the x9 mcd red room lighter brandon murray mindset podcast elf mc panical Lacan, atomic wall luzio ice wallow bow Nez, bottle of water, it's Tuesday, bloody hell, chance of free stock, dead and jelly, skull joe, zabu, the fat milk, dusty crumples, jay, drunk dog, I'm taught, cheer to death, and pinnacle, thank you all so much, you help support me a lot, I mean you know that already, um, but truly thank you, everyone else, I've already said it, um, but leave a like, subscribe, yeah, I'm sounding like a bag now, okay, <laughs> anyway, have a good rest of your days, uh, hopefully I'll beat like, fucking cataclysm soon, we'll, we'll, we'll have to see, uh, but until then, yeah, like I said, have a great rest of your days. I love you all. Shut the fuck up and peace.